Hey, welcome back to another episode of Cooking with Lunkers. <laughs> uh, for those of you that probably don't know Lunkers, uh, I don't know where you've been, but anywho, um, I'm here at his house with my boy Matt. He's running the camera. Thank you, Matt. <laughs> and uh, we're going to show him how to cook baby back ribs yeah. <clears throat> on the pit barrel. I need some help. I want to be honest with you guys. My last ones I cooked, he showed me, he told me through the phone how to do it. I'll tell you right now, that's it's not. They were burned quite significantly. I did not I think you could. I, I, I like it. Not my mother in law. She didn't like them. <clears throat> they needed sauce. Well, and that's okay. But uh, for this recipe, super simple, super easy. Little SPG, little Texas beef. We're going to pull the membranes on the back, throw them on there, and let the smoke and the fire do the rest. So you ready? Yeah. I'm gonna do, I'll do a couple, okay. and then let you do a couple. How's that sound? Okay. Um, you told me to pull the membrane off last time. I didn't. I forgot. Okay. So. Well, and it's okay. This knife. This oh, is. No, no, I see that. Yeah. This is not a, a sponsored ad, but I just got this knife the other day, and. Yeah, they'll do some damage to your hands. <laughs> it's a razor, and I don't think that was probably wise for me, but anywho. We'll just jump right into it. What I like to do is I just take this butter knife, flip it right around either side, just run it under a rib. It's like skinning a catfish. But I always have some of these laying around just to grab it. And you can see sometimes you get it all, sometimes you don't. That's okay. Just get another run at it. And we'll set that one right there. There you go. That's the one. Ah! I spoke a little bit too soon, didn't I? If you come in on this side right here, the front side, and just ride that bone down. And then I lift it up, and that's when I slide my thumb. Quit doing it. That was almost all the way down, huh? That was that was about as perfect as you can get right there. Cosmo, I think you seem to Yeah, I need to quit, man. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so when I see them I, with the uh, SPG and the Texas beef, I don't go crazy. I just do like that. And I just I just just a this this a Okay. What does SPG stand for? Salt, pepper, garlic. Now, let's flip them all over and we'll do it again. But this time on the top, we'll hit a little Texas beef. My goal is to be the person that in our area that everybody's like, you know what? I'm gonna go to his house and eat his meat and put his meat in my mouth. That's the man to be. <laughs> now I go easy with this, it's a little finer. So what's in this? Or is this secret? This secret. You can read it on the back. <laughs> <laughs> you can also get this on my website too. But they know this. Uh, so so for this, I know this, I know this, I know this, I know this. You got second this? rib down? Second rib down. It's kind of like when you, you do a... If you ever stuck a needle in somebody's chest because they couldn't breathe, you go to their nipple and two ribs down. Every day. That's what you do. If I had a nickel. Right there. Correct? I, here's what I like to do. Wow, that should Because you know how all the ribs are different. I just like to make sure I expose enough where I can hang it on there without having to move the meat out of the way. So. So you go there. Okay, I see what you're saying. Okay. I that's what, what I would do. I didn't know what I was talking about then. At least I had the right end though. This pit barrel has became my favorite. It's made me actually look like the dude that knows what he's doing. It's in hot just easy. And we'll take him outside. We'll get the pit barrel running. Throw right him on. Don't do By the way, that handle is a little toasty, just in case you were wondering. So I'm gonna hang them pretty quick, <laughs> so we can get that fire tone down. So, see that thing down there? Mm -hmm. Is that too much? No, no, right there. That's, that's perfect. Good. We'll throw the lid on her. Two, two hours, two and a half hours later, we'll be eating ribs. Hey, so it's been right at about two hours. We're gonna check these things and I'll, I'll let Lungers check them. 
I want you to actually show me. Make sure I'm doing so, this. So what I do is I just stick them right there. How far down in? Just right down in there, maybe about an inch. And when it hits about 70, 177 to 180, that's when I that's when I call it good. 161.4? 161.4. That's about right. So about 30 more minutes. And... Uh, so it goes 16 degrees in 30 minutes? Yeah. And I, here, here, So here's how we can absolutely do it. You can... Uh, Put a little crack right in there. Really? Oh yeah. That's it? Yep. So we'll see you in 30 minutes. These suckers will be done. We'll rest them, throw the corn on, and then continue on. All right. So it's been right at two and a half hours. These things are up to temp. We're gonna get them off. Get them taken inside. Get them rested. Oops, sir. And uh, prep some store-bought potato salad. That's it. <laughs> Damn. I'm just getting full blown. Just smoked out there. We call that we call that the smoke dummy. <laughs> Look at oh, that. That is so much that's that's a bit better than mine. Is this mother in law prints? That's, that's way better than mine. Mine was done. I guess I was just scared. Don't be scared, they say. Oh Lordy Lord, look at that. Look at that. Yes, that is right. <laughs> oh, Oh, did I get you? I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that smoke in the eyes is what I like. Brought to you by Lunkers TV. No, it's mainly just Cosmo. No, it ain't, dude. You did all this. <laughs> this is all you, bro. I can't wait to stick These are good, dude. Oh. These are going to be so good. This is proper. This is this is how you deal with uh, heated metal in a, for OSHA approved. Well, I'm really hot, by the way. Just come turn it out. <laughs> <laughs> I feel it through this glove 100%. We'll get these suckers inside and rest them. Uh, rested. 20 minutes. 20 minutes? 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Yeah, I remember. Good night, little bitch. See you in 20 minutes. <laughs> and this is a. Uh, for pair, or for uh, flare, corn stars. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is the corn hub right here. There we go. I had a nickel. All right, so we're done. We're done cooking everything. It's about 8.30 at night and we're hungry. And we're ready to eat. So we're gonna make this short and sweet. I wanna thank my chef, Lunkers. She got big nuts. For nailing these ribs. Big nuts. And is that not beautiful? <laughs> See what she called it? What? She goes, it's a big chicken nugget. <laughs> yeah, chicken nugget. It's a big chicken nugget. Oh, wow, I should have done that. I peeled them off last time. So, do you see this? Yeah, but he's cutting that chicken nugget. Look at that. You guys ready to eat? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you want to hey, you want to taste one first? Yeah. You want to you want to taste one? Yeah. Let's, let's see your work. That's good. <laughs> hey, I want to thank you guys for watching. As always, smash that subscribe button and click that bell so you don't miss a thing. And I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.